Hello everyone, welcome to this little introduction video for the first in a series of game asset creation videos where I take you through uh, creating very very simple 3D models but showing you the entire process of taking them from modeling uh, right through to texturing and getting them ready for use in a game engine. This series is designed for my students primarily but I'm putting it on YouTube so that anyone can get a look at it but bear in mind it is being aimed towards people with absolutely no 3D experience whatsoever. You'll see here that I have added a complexity rating of one star to this, which means it's probably the simplest 3D model I can make. As we go on, we're going to start making more and more complex models, and you'll be able to tell just by looking at the picture here how complex it is if it is at your skill level or beyond. Uh, let's get a little look at what we're going to make today. So we're going to make this little tombstone. Very, very simple, very low poly, it's about 70 odd polys. Uh, and what we're going to do is, first of all, we're going to make it in 3D Studio Max. Then we are going to unwrap it in there. We're going to export that, take it into ZBrush, where we are then going to sculpt in a lot of high poly detail. So where you can see the little circular pattern there, the text, the scratches and claw marks and chips out of that, we're going to sculpt those in ZBrush. And then finally, we're going to move over into Substance Painter, where we will texture the whole thing. At the end of it, we'll export everything that we need and we'll have all the assets ready to go into Unreal or Unity or your game engine of choice. And that should be you good to go. So to point out for this, you don't necessarily need ZBrush. You could skip out part two of this. Um, you'll lose some of the detail in your final model. But if you don't have ZBrush at home, you can skip out part two. Uh, that I think is everything, so we're going to move over to part one now and we'll get cracking. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy the series.